Welcome to the channel, it's Matt the Garden and Lawn Care Guy and today we're going to be doing the first cut with this Swordman Electra 45. So I've got the machine set up and ready to go. You can see a uh, beautiful red colour and super nice grass box. So I've just set the Swordman up on the highest setting which is um, just over 40 mil. It's like a quick release clasp on the side here and then coming around this way there's a retaining bolt here just an allen key and you get all the parts that you need in this little bag which you can keep safe up here So I used to have this um, bit of an issue with my other cylinders as well, is this sleeper bed coming quite close to the grass and you've got the motor on the side of the mower. So what I think I'll have to do is basically mow in the other direction so the clean face almost is pointing in and it gives me a bit more clearance. I've also noticed that it's such a true cut. I don't even think there's hardly anything coming off. So you can see in there, just a couple of whiskers. Now this was being cut on, I don't know, maybe um, 40 or 50 mil on the Bosch. And you can see here, there's actually nothing coming off. So what that means is this must be a much truer cut than the rotary mower. And I'm actually gonna drop this down to, let's say um, 30 mil and see how we get going. Go. Okay, so you can see it's cutting really, really nicely. Um, as this is a bit of a bigger machine, I'm getting sort of super thick stripes, but you can also still see from the um, height of cut, it's really not taking much off at all. So I'm actually gonna uh, drop the height down again. And I mean, those Bosch cutters were set, I think it must have been like 40 odd mil, but this is just hardly taking a lick, just a small little snippet off the top. So um, I think I'm gonna drop it again to maybe 25 mil, um, finish the first cut at 30 mil and then drop it to 25 um, and just to see what we've got left. Now obviously there's a bit of um, sort of just setting up and getting used to this. Obviously when I'm in full swing, I'm not gonna have to make this many adjustments to the mower, I'm just finding the right height. So. That's us at 25 mil.
looking super nice. I made a bit of a mistake on this one. I was uh, concentrating on too many things. Should have done another one, another one that way. But overall, that is not bad for March. Look at that, beautiful. And if you have a look at what's inside the box, these are like really, really fine skimmings. So you can see overall the cut quality is beautiful. Um, it's given me a really nice stripe and it's not bad at all considering it's uh, what uh, March time. It's the first cut I've done with a uh, roller mower. Um, really nice and easy to move. The differential makes a huge difference to the maneuverability of the mower. So overall after the first mower you can see the grass looks absolutely stunning. Consider this is uh, March time. I can't really ask for much better than that. Some things that really stood out to me was um, just how quiet it is. You can't really believe how quiet it is. The wider width of the mower uh, also made a difference. So you can see these stripes are like a double pass stripe and they really set the lawn off. Uh, and also just like the fineness of the cut, um, it was quite easy to get used to, uh, nice and easy to move. That rear split roller makes a big difference. Um, I had a couple of problems with just like um, stuff laid out around the garden, like the sleepers. Um, I had to mow in a certain way to, to, to get past them. And also the uh, planter just there, because um, the grass box at the front's got quite a sort of um, bit of width on it. Uh, I couldn't get to the end without colliding with that. So I'm just gonna make a couple of changes around the garden just to optimize it and, and uh, get used to the mower really. Leave me a comment down in the comment section below. Let me know how you think it went and if you've got any questions about this machine. Uh, but overall, I'm pretty impressed. It's Matt, the Garden and Lawn Care Guy. And if you've enjoyed this video, consider subscribing to my channel for more content on the Swordman and UK Lawn Care.